Hi guys, welcome back. And today, guys, we're doing like a mini face cam tutorial. And uh, that I'm gonna show you how to like zoom in in your face cam and zoom out, like in certain clips, like a Fortnite clip, if you want to zoom in, do some effects to your face cam and stuff like that. And this is all gonna be in Kinmaster on your phone. <laughs> this quick tutorial the comment of the day comes from F money the god and he says okay in the video put zooming on the face cam the voice changer and black and white on the phone yeah that's what we're gonna do in this video although you just said we're gonna put in this video we put zooming on face cam the voice change I mean we soon we're gonna put voice changer but other than that we did all the rest of the stuff Thank you so much for your question, F Money the God. And but yeah, we're gonna try to do a tutorial on the voice changer, but for now, well that's gonna be the next tutorial. Okay guys, now obviously for the rest of this tutorial it's gonna be on phone and I'm not gonna have a on um, face cam so you can see the effects. So first you wanna get your primary primary clip, so you're gonna click new project. There you go, 16 to 9 media. Okay, click media, then click all, then you want to click like a gameplay or whatever um, you want to do. There you go, see that's our gameplay, I'm, I was playing like the floor is lava, so you click check mark. I'm um, pinching in the clip so it fits with the timeline, I'm zooming in the clip basically. And the entire clip, you have to make sure the entire clip fits on the timeline because if, it, if it's like 3 or 5 minutes, it's not going to fit on the timeline. So that's why our clip is short. It's 1 minute and 40 seconds. That's why it fits on the timeline. And now we're going to get some face cams. We're going to click layer. Then you click media. <coughs> And click all. And guys, if you like these kind of uh, kinds of videos, smash the like button and subscribe because we're gonna post uh, videos like this every Sunday. Keep in mind this face cam. This face cam doesn't relate to the gameplay, but it's just an example to give you guys an idea. So we're gonna click on this blue face cam, I guess. There you go. We have a face cam now. We're gonna cut it to match the other clip. So we're gonna uh, click on um, this clip because we cut it and click delete. And there yep. you go, now it matches. And now they're saying length, the same length, and now they're gonna last the same time. So obviously, um, guys, so the first step you do, see this is way too big for your screen, you wanna see the gameplay as well. So first you shrink it to the corner of your screen. There you go, now click cropping. <coughs> now I click check mark, and boom, that's our face game. There you go, that's our face cam, guys. Now let's do the face cam effect. See, now I'm playing my gameplay. I'm just playing my gameplay. But for a couple seconds, then something cool happens, and maybe you want to um, zoom in. So this is how you do it. You're going to click your face cam clip and make it yellow. And then click um, trim and split. You're going to click split up play head. Oh, uh, okay, guys. Now, now what you want to do, since we um cut it, now you want to do two seconds into the timeline. It depends on how much um uh, how much seconds you want to zoom in. But in this case, in this example, we're gonna do only for two seconds. There you go. Now it's um one second, guys. Um, now we're gonna click um the clip and now click uh, trim split. Split that playhead. And there you go. Now click this little clip. Make it bigger, and there you go. Now click check mark, and it should be, and it should zoom um in, should zoom out, guys. Yeah. See, there you go, guys. For one second, for one second, actually two guys, two seconds, guys, it zoomed in. Now I'm gonna show you how to do sl the slow zoom in. So we're gonna click the clip. And um, guys, around the middle to the left, there's gonna be like this little circle with a key inside it, and it's actually called key framing. So you're gonna click it. You're gonna click that add button on the top with the circle. And now um, we make it big. Then we're gonna slide the timeline until how many seconds we want this um effect to um go. To basically zoom in. Now click um, the, the add sign again. 
and click check mark. Okay, so now when I play it, there's gonna be a zoom and there's gonna be a fast zoom in, then there's gonna be a slow zoom in. So there you go. Now play it. I have See, there you go. That's that's what happened, guys. But now we're gonna make it even slower, like right now. Now we're gonna make it for a couple of more seconds so it can be even slower because that was um, just a little fast. And I'm gonna click the clip because still you click, click the key sign, click add, and now hold it until how many seconds you want. Let's say like this. Now click the add button again. <coughs> now we're gonna make it zoom in. And now click check mark. See now when I play it, it's gonna zoom in a little slower. I have Valkyrie. See there you go, it's really slow. It's really slow guys and it's zooming in. Now I'm, now I'm gonna show you how to like change the color on your face cam. Let's say like this certain moment we want to change it to black and white. So this is how you do it. You click on the clip, you click um, you click filter, then click basic color effects. Then you want let's say um what um I'll just get it black and white, there you go. <laughs> Look at me now. Oh, sorry guys, my bad. Now that's negative, that's negative. So we're gonna get black and white now. Like, click that. D there, that's black and white. That was negative before. Now when you play it, that little part's gonna be black and white. Correct, yeah, yep, there you go, see, it's black and white. Now we're gonna zoom it in, but this time with the music. But guys, and before you even start keyframing, split the clip in half because if you don't, the keyframing effect is just going to last forever until the other part of the, the, um, the clips. Okay, now we're going to pretty much zoom in with the fingers again. Now we, now we zoomed in the timeline and these few seconds takes up the entire timeline so now we can be very specific on where we want to put the music. You're gonna click audio, and then you can um, add audio. Obviously, you don't wanna add a copyrighted audio, so you're gonna go to internal. And uh, make sure when you click internal, make sure you add songs that is not like copyrighted. Like, if it's not your song, don't choose it. But if you have rights to choose that song, then you can choose that song. But for now, we're not gonna choose like a copyrighted song. And we're gonna choose St. Francis. See, there you go, that's the clip. And now you're gonna click add. There you go. Now you have your audio and it's gonna play in the face cam. And then guys, so there is our um, clip. Now we're gonna put it for um, a couple seconds. But guys, obviously there's no like sad parts about this gameplay. I just did it as an example. But if it's a really epic moment, then you probably want like, you know, uh, good music. Now we're going go we're now we're gonna go to the end of the zoom in and where it ends. See it ends right here. Then you click on uh, this clip and um shrink shrinking as um when when um when your zoom in starts and shrink it as long as your um zoom in um starts like as long as your zoom in um starts make it so it makes that music it's the same time as your face cam and you can actually lower the music so gently there you go now click check mark and now we're gonna play the clip. I have Valkyrie, it doesn't come with editing styles, it's just plain old Valkyrie with the, you, you guys know, like, the, this wasn't... See how it's that, that was cool, right? Okay guys, so that's the, that was the basics of how to do the face cam tutorial, that, that's the basics. I, I um, did the color changing, I zoomed in and I zoomed out, I did a uh, keyframing, guys, that's just the basics. There's so much you can do in KinMaster, there's a lot of different effects, there's a lot of different filters, guys, but I'm just gonna show you, I'm just showing you the basics, but anyways, guys, I hope you enjoy, smash that like button, subscribe for more videos, and see you next time. Bye guys!